So hey guys, this is RVO, and welcome back in another brand new video. So today in this video I'm going to show you, how you can fix your infinity loading screen, or black screen issue in Apex Legends, and in this video I'm going to show you a few ways to fix it. Hopefully it will work for you guys. So watch full video carefully, and don't miss any steps and details. And before moving further most importantly make sure to create a restore point. So if you will do any mistake in the steps you can restore your PC back to your old settings. So for that, first go to start menu. Then search create restore point. Click here. Then choose C drive make sure its protection is on. Then click on create button. Type any name. Hit create. And it will take few seconds. And it's done. So. Now let's move into our three main methods, and make sure to check, that you have everything updated. Your windows and your graphic drivers. Make sure they both have latest drivers. So, for our first method, open your Steam. Go to Apex Legends. Then, right click on it. Go to Properties. Then, go to Local Files. Click on Browse. Find R5 Apex. Right click on it. Properties. Then, Go to Compatibility Mode. Then, check this run program in Compatibility Mode. And change Windows 8 to Windows 7. And, hit Apply. After this, restart your Steam or Origin. For second method. First, open your Steam or Origin. Then, open your Task Manager. Go to Details. Then find Steam or Origin which one you are using. Then, right click on it, and go to Set Affinity. Then uncheck all of the CPUs. Only check CPU 0 and last CPU. In my case it's 7, it can be more or, it can be less in your case. Then, close Task Manager. Open your game now. After your game gets open, wait for 30 seconds. And let's see these methods are working or not. If you can enter the lobby, then wow it's done for you. Congratulation. But if you are still facing, the same problem, you can do one more thing. For third method, just close your game, and your Steam or Origin. Then go to Start Menu. Search CMD. Run it as Administrator. After this, copy-paste this command. You will get it in my description. And after successfully done, close CMD. And now, try to launch your game. Hopefully this step will fix your issue. So guys, if you are able to enter in your lobby, and if this video helped you, you can tell me your experience in comment section. And if you have any problem you can ask from me in comment section. And don't forget to like the video, and share with friends who are facing the same issues. And subscribe my channel for more upcoming video. So now I'll see you in next video. Peace.